What up players, this is Sabro54 on the WhimsyG Players channel. We have a double feature with Boa Hancock once again. Did I do a double feature with her before? I think the last one was with, uh, was it with Barona? Oh no, I think I did do it with her actually, yeah. I, I played against uh, the starter deck brothers. It was Sabo and Luffy. Those went pretty well. Anyways, we're playing against Reiju. I don't have too much experience playing against her, but it's pretty much the Germa deck. Uh, gonna attack for 5k. She put all the Dawn, so I mean, I had to let that happen with the attack. Get the Weevil down. You know, you don't want a really big hand with Boa because then you can't really use um, her ability. Like when you remove stuff, you don't draw. And it just defeats the purpose. You want to just use the counter so you can defend yourself and then replenish your hand with her effect. So Portia comes down and uh, Vince Smoke Ichiji does the combo. Vince Smoke, well, just uh, Niji, not Ichiji. Pretty sure I read Ichiji there. But anyway, you get rid of the regular dude and then you get the one with the suit, basically. That's what they do. And I do the double. Summon, might as well get rid of the Margarets from the hand, because they're useless in hand. Give myself a little bit of defense. I'm already at 3 life. I mean, he's putting some serious pressure. Um, if I play the uh, Pudding, it should affect him pretty bad, but I gotta defend myself here. I hope he just attacks with like 6k attackers, just that. Don't like do any extra dawn shit. Block, get rid of some stuff from the hand. Okay, perfect. Use those bitches perfectly. And then summon chopper too. So eight dawns, what are we really doing? Um, I guess I'm gonna attack Porsche. He blocked. So with just five cards, I'm not really doing much if I play the Pudding, so I'm just gonna summon some attackers Man, Pudding just never works out for me most of the time. It's like every time I have her. It's like I can't really utilize her to Hand disrupt my opponent. I'm only running one copy. I really don't want to do more than that but Yeah, I guess everything else fails. You can just discard it for a thousand from the hand it just doesn't make sense though to not run at least one because she is a heavy duty disruption card at the right time at the end of the day. You know, people would probably say I'm bad if I didn't run her at all. Okay, so 7k. Um, do I have shit to defend myself? Still no. Down to two life, goddamn. A uh, bunch of dawns, 8k. Shit. I'm going to do you guys and even the searcher. So that was a lot of discarding, but I defended myself because I'm almost dead and now he goes for 8k again. Fuck. But I mean, he's just using all the dawns trying to really just kill me super fast and not summoning stuff. I'll just, I'll kill the dudes next turn then. And then I'll, I guess, build up my defenses. We can summon Kaido too. But I won't really be able to draw much. So I'm just going to do the double here. Just get a bunch of summons. And uh, kill his dudes. I guess, should I do Weevil as well? Just going to leave him with two dawns. I think they'll make sense. Uh, you know what? Let me just remove something, actually. Go this direction. So I can hit his life, too. Because, I mean, whether I summon Weevil or whether I just use the removal... Mm, I guess the idea is kind of the same. He is trying to protect the bitch, though. So, maybe it's good what I did. So now, two dawns on Boa. Can you protect her again? Seven. No, he let her die. But now you got no field. And I got like four dudes. Okay. So even though I'm almost dead when it comes to life. 
I'm, I have control over the game, so to speak. Uh, summons Reiju. And that dude, but I'm just gonna remove both of them instantly with the gravity blade. I was just waiting for this moment. Summon some big cost dudes. I can get rid of them at once. Okay. And we're just gonna make a lot of attacks now, and he's gonna be almost dead, and he just scoops. Wow. Okay. Controlled the game well, it would seem. Um, I don't know why he scooped. Uh, I guess maybe I would have won. He was gonna summon a bunch of dude next turn but maybe it was gonna be too late anyway so now we're playing against dragon first time playing against this guy and yeah I, I do wonder if people think if this card is really that good it's almost like the effect is pretty similar with the starter deck Luffy like the first one uh, which I guess it makes sort of sense it's a father and son. Got a similar effect. You gotta put two dons though with this guy. And uh, I believe you can't put it. I think there is some kind of limitation, but anyway. Okay, so block the attack. Got the double search down. Gonna attack your ass. And I will summon. Weevil. Okay. It's got this Monkey D. Luffy, which is from the first set. Uh, it's pretty weak, but I guess if you put Dawns, it does some stuff. So, 5k. I do want to block. I guess I'll do the Boa, because he's just a thousand. And... What else? Summon this dude as well. Oh, right. Through the dude's effect. That's some crazy shit, man. I gotta let this happen. Hey, this guy's putting some pressure. So six dawns is a bit awkward because I only can get one summon and then... Oh shit, yeah, 3k. It's kind of stupid attacking. Uh, anyway, I mean... It didn't block anyway, so maybe it doesn't matter, but whatever. Um, so, he's at 3, I'm at 4. But he has a lot of field presence. Uh, as long as that fucking like um, crow dude is alive, he can just do shit to decrease my leader's attack. And he can just easily attack me with more dudes and it's harder for me to block. That's the thing. And there's not much I can do with it. I mean, he is going to attack with him. So now I'm at 4,000. But I gotta do something. I can't just... I'm gonna do double. Double 2k. So we blocked. I, I can't do this again though. Shit. Uh, I'll do double of you. Because I mean if we're gonna have a lot of costs. I'm gonna summon just one big dude. Yeah I think I gotta make sure I have life. Because this guy's putting some pressure. Got to make sure we have a decent life. As I'm just going to try and clear his dudes. So attack the dude. He's going to save him. Attack the dude again. He's going to save him again. I'm not surprised he's doing that. And Boa is going to attack too. Saves him again. Okay. And I'm going to do Weevil. I didn't really draw any defense, so I, I'm almost thinking I fucked up here. Maybe I should have just put Dawns and make sure I killed the dude. So, he summons the Rush Dragon as well, so that's bad news. Something big that can attack. It makes me, makes me 4,000. Man, I really won't be able to defend against this shit. I get Crocodile. 
Uh, Ivankov summons the Crowded again. Fuck. And now even Bella Betty can attack. I discard Sengoku. I mean, 5k, what the fuck can we do? I mean, I only got Crocodile for defense. Um, I did see a trigger, though. So... I managed to avoid one attack, get rid of the Ivankov. But... Man... I'm at zero life now. So I just barely survived. But I'm at zero life. So this just means... I gotta win this turn, or I'm toast. Okay, so I get rid of the dragon, and I, I'm already thinking I fucked up. I should've just... I'm such a dumbass, but this is why I hate the dance system, man. It's just... I guess if I attacked, was I gonna be able to just do enough to just finish him off with all these dudes? Maybe, I don't know. Now all I can do is attack the leader, but it's basically just going to come close to dying, and... Put a bunch of dons on Sengoku, make some 6k. He blocks, and then I just attack with Boa, and then he's going to block. So yeah, what I should have done, and I would have had game, is instead of using Red Rock, save the dons, Put them on another dude and he wasn't going to be able to block in all probability. And I guess maybe I could have won. Yeah. Instead of I just attacking dudes. Now I'm toast for sure. But anyway, it just goes to show you. Uh, you can't make any misplays with razor thin marches like these. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the matches. Subscribe to the channel. Leave a like. Share the video with your friends. And I'll see you guys next time. What are you?